Here's your WNEM TV5 news update. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Trevor Sahaki. Here's a look at the top stories we're following today. Saginaw police are investigating a shooting in the 1600 block of Owen Street. No word yet on the condition of those involved or information on a possible suspect. Stay with TV5 as we are working to learn more. Firefighters in Clio are responding to a house fire on North Lewis Road between Wilson and Dodge. A neighbor tells TV5 he woke up and saw the fire already outside. Yeah, I was knocking on their doors over here to get them up and them over here. And then the, this house here, we was knocking on their place to wake them up because sparks were just all over the place. The Clio fire chief says the house is a total loss, but no one was home at the time and the homeowner has been contacted. The fire remains under investigation. A man accused of selling drugs and running a dog fighting operation is due back in a Genesee County courtroom. Markel Holmes is scheduled for a pre-trial hearing. Police say Holmes was found during two separate raids with drugs and dog fighting equipment. Two dozen malnourished injured dogs were recovered from those raids. Three of them had to be put down. The hearing starts at 1.30. And now here's John with a look at your forecast. Thank you very much, Trevor. Let's go over the forecast as we're going throughout your Monday, starting off a brand new week on the right foot. You've got another nice day today. Lots of sunshine, mild temperatures well above average. We'll call for the mid-60s this afternoon. That will come with a breeze on the southwest at about 5 to 15 miles per hour. Gusts at times could be near 20. For the overnight period tonight, we get a little bit more in the way of some cloud cover. I think it's dry. We'll watch for the chance for some patchy fog into your Tuesday morning. Lows tonight back down into the mid-40s. For the seven-day forecast, there will be the chance for a few showers as we go into tomorrow. Better chances for the afternoon. Wednesday, mainly dry. Temps back in the 50s. And then we watch another system moving in as we go into your Veterans Day throughout the rest of the weekend. Cooler temperatures for the weekend, setting up more for a lake effect scenario. It means we could have a few more snow showers mixing in by Saturday and Sunday. In the first Warren 5 Weather Center, I'm meteorologist John Gross. Remember to tune into WNEM TV 5 on air and online 24-7 for the latest news, weather, and information.